What is going on everybody, man? King Recon here today for the first time in about a month and a half to read the one and the only, the greatness, the awesome sauce, the epitome of greatness and hype when it comes to me catching up to a series at this point in time. You know, I'm catching up to a few series, but none of them are giving me the same feeling as Let's get right into it, chapter 250, Togan. Oh, man, say, real, and the man who wielded the true power in the chin court, Chancellor Lufui. Under the watchful gazes of these two men, soldiers clad in black set out from the royal capital in Canton towards the lands of Sanyo. From the expressions on their faces, one could tell that each of them were holding back thoughts. Twenty days later, that black-clad party arrives at the Sanyo city. Who are they? And three days after that, in the large courtyard of Sanyo City, were gathered all the various units who had successfully subjugated Sanyo's surroundings, as well as the officials responsible for Sanyo's administrative work. Chapter 250, Togan. And there's a lot of them showing up here. That was going on. It's freaking hot, hot being fit for us to gather up here. My boy, shit. They're probably here to congratulate us on the subjugation. You know, whenever I, I go back to reading Kingdom, you know, because the way that I've done it, I've noticed, is like... I take a little break, then I come back, read a bunch of chapters, then then I, I take another break. So uh, hopefully this will lead to a lot, lot uh, in, another um, sprout and a whole bunch of uh, reads. Because man, I've, I've, been, I've been dying to read some Kingdom Awesome sauce, guys. They're probably here to grant us on the subjugation, but isn't it's that ten, ten? But isn't it weird that they even brought out the officials? Mot Moten sama. Have you heard anything about this? I've got nothing. It's the it's the Goku. Oh, even the Goku, the Goku oh, no, left the subject. It's a joke. Okay, region has come back to the city. That's their captain, one thousand man commander Owen. Where's my man Conky at though, bro? That's the question. Owen. So that bastard's finally finished cleaning up his area. It took him long enough. Ka 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 ka. I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure the Goku Ho was able to swiftly subjugate their allotted region and was even able to quell another three areas before coming here. And they ring a gong. What, what's that? Who are those guys in the black getup? Oh, don't tell me they're Moten Sama, isn't that? Yeah, they're an elite bodyguard directly under the Chin Royal Court. In other words, it seems to dispatch some important people. Yo, that's Sensei, oh, the chief of military affairs, the chief himself. The chief has come to the front lines. Isn't that the re chief of administration behind Sensei? I better think about this. Two members of the four pillars of Freya have come to Sanyo. Looks like this is untrue. Here right now, so the direction that our kingdom of Chen will concern this region of Sanyo. From today onwards, this, the region of Sanyo will have changed its name to Togan of the Chen Kingdom. In in addition, we will have 10,000 Chen citizens from our various cities immigrated here. Immigration, 10,000? That's the name administration managers this region will be. Any original inhabitants that could not agree to these terms will be evicted by force. Here it comes. Hence, understand that from this moment onwards, this region of Togan has now become a part of Chen soil, and, is to be, and, it, and it is to be protected no matter the cost. At all costs, they must protect this. That is all. What? Just what? The Chen's Declaration of Intention. Declaration of Intention? At this period in history, the constant tug of war for land between states was considered the norm. However, due to how common it was for a recently conquered territory to be taken immediately, States also this superficial was considered an unusual move. It firmly expressed Chin's resolve in never letting this region be taken from their hands, while at the same time it also acted as a, as a president, signifying that the same thing could happen in the future. In other words, in the fifth year of Sei's reign, the announcement was a declaration of war of, of the entire continent that said that Chin had truly begun to expand its borders. A declaration of war to the entire continent? Apparently, I've been assigned to. Holy crap! I, I, I've been assigned to keep it for, same for us. So, yo, man, these, these three dudes, legit, they're 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 like the Law Luffy kid, uh, you know, little three 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 act thing. Because Konki, I I can I can kind of see him as more like a, like a black beard, uh, in a, in a sort of sense because. I I al I can already tell just just how okay, he's he's kid he's like kid when it comes to the savagery, but I I can tell like this is like this is like the three that I can see them working together in the future, but Conky man I I can legit see him and Shin just duking it out you know what I mean just going in on each other yo that's my boy right there man, let me see, this is the first time all three of us have gathered together since that night we came up with the Rinko battle plan isn't it 
Sure brings back memories. I've been keeping up in touch. I've been keeping in touch with Shin occasionally. But this is the first time I've seen him. I will, yeah. Let's go to see. Oh, don't talk to me. <laughs> what kind of face is this? That's like the face that you have whenever you, whenever you bust a nut after being dry for so long. Look at those veins. You're like, Ugh. just comes out, man. Like, like there's no tomorrow. Look. <laughs> I gotta save that. Yeah, I gotta use that as a, as a meme in the future. My boy Shin was in dry season. He let it all out at one point in time. Well, I mean, I can't really um, doubt him. Or deny him. What is this noise over here? Put on the volume a little bit over here. Oh, and don't get the wrong idea. I didn't come here to make pleasant small talk. I'm here to get information from you, nothing else. Information? Don't play innocent. You were Shohei Kun's former student. That's right. Now that I think about it, Ten mentioned that too. I haven't really heard of anything. Things seem to be just as they appear. For the central figures of Chen and Shogun. That's simply how important of a base this nail we've driven into way is. Considering the loss of General Oki, man. That was out that, that that's still one of my favorite chapters, man. General Oki greatness. And the wounded General Mogo from the last battle. Mogo. It's not retired, and it's clear that Chin's military is weakened. I think myself, no, well, I'm not really sure why we gotta boot all the original citizens out, but at any rate, kicking them all out and declaring war on all the other states ain't bad at all. Isn't a time of fierce warfare just what we wanted? If we sit around and drag our feet, then we're not going to be able to finish it all in our generation. <laughs> My boy Shin, man. It, it, it's factual, though, because when you think about it, this is something that, that the, the, the entire goal is something that would take so many years. But he has like, this urgency, this sense of, I need to do this now while I still, I'm still young, while I still have a shot. So, that's very interesting there. I don't want to a huge losing streak. <laughs> that you say, asshole. Let me see. It's just to you. Where is the money? Stimulate. What he means is that a storm is coming to China as a whole. Case. Then we need one minute. If the whole of China is going to be begin moving, start rolling. We'll definitely be that man. It's our royal cap captain, Kantan. So as I thought, we have no but to begin. General Kosan, how do you? Yo, yeah, yeah, th th this is where I left off, right? And then in this particular, I think, I think this was, this was where I left off. No, we will be attacking the state of Yan. Yan? The governor will be you. Who do you, who do you, Sava? Yo, it's just something about his design. He's this, he's nasty, yo. Who the hell? Is that Hogan? Wait, is that the legend? Wait, 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 wait. I do believe it's about time we woke him up. He still looks like a savage. That's Hogan, dude. Go, go, go. Next page, next page. Oh, man, I gotta see what I'm my boy, bro. Go! Hogan. Damn it, man. Go, go, go. Go. Let me see. Side story. Yo, this is a beautiful cover. Wow. What is this? I'm just skimming through this. What, what's got this? It says a side story. This is interesting. Yo, this is, this looks really a beast. Side story. I'm kind of kind of kind of want to read it. Yo, this looks goat. I don't know if I should. Let me know. Let me know in the comment section if I, could, if I, if I should read this this side story. But for right now, I think I'll I'm gonna continue. General of Yan. All right, I think this is continuing where I left off. Kingdom. Is that my girl? <laughs> I gotta save that page right there, man. I miss her, y'all. It's been, it's, been, it's, been it's been a while since I've seen her. Well, of course in the manga too, but just overall. Also, this is the start of a new volume right here. And I'll say, Kyokai, my girl. Hoken, dude. Hoken. Man, my body's ready, dude. <sighs> It's like it's just looking at these guys to get ready. The memories are coming back whenever I was reading this. I'm ready, dude. Greatness, man. Oh, this is an awesome page. All right, let's continue. Hoken, though. Yo, they're gonna awaken the beast, the monster. Hoken, look at this, man. His, his, his double face spreads around this world. Look, look at these close-ups on his face. You can feel his veins. Yo, dude, he's just he's just a savage man. I, like whenever I first saw him, I was like, because he, he he was like that first. Oki was like the first larger than life character, but I felt like 
host. Oh, 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 wait, this dude Hogan was savage, man. Like, he, he was a tank. He was going in. I thought this man had like superpowers or something. Yo. Crazy, dude. Just, just that was just pure skill, though. Pure skill, man. Pure skill and experience. But I understand the rumors of you being known as the manifestation of violence. My boy is Tommy Dreamer, man. The innovator of violence. What is about having a surprise? Like my downer. Were you sent by that man? In case you want to Roku Sama's vessels. Though it seems you already have my intentions. I bring a message from Riboku Sama. Even that you, you find yourself unable to cut through Oki's shadow, no matter how many great trees you fell. The answer must lie in the battlefield. Hogan, look at that! Look at that play, dude. He took out so many dudes. The co the, the 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 spreads that happened there. Oh, I just ah! this dude, Hogan Sama of the Great Heavens. Hogan has been appointed to the commander. You say, Hogan, man, and you know Shin got beef with him, yo. Yan, out of all the states in China, Yan can be considered the one that holds the most mysteries. Listen, Yan, looking at the eastern fringe and then the, and the entirely opposite side of China from Chin. But up until recently, there was a small mountain kingdom with the name of Shuzan located at the entrance between Yan and the rest of China. So in the past, we'd often have our communications cut off there. Well, it's unknown why a small kingdom like like that happened to exist there. But there there have been unsavory rumors that Yan, excuse me, is colluded with the various different tribes. What's the general called? Gek. Excuse me, Gekishin. That was around 40 years ago, the state of Yama. Yo, look at this smile. He has a beard, Gekishin. 40 years ago, the state of Yama was on the verge of extinction from, from, from encroaching key forces from Ge when, when Gekishin and the now deceased military god, Gakuki, were able to completely turn in the tide and push the key forces all the way back until they were almost completely wiped out. The savior of the great of the kingdom, great general Gekishin. This guy looks looks pretty beast. I look like his beard going on down here, man. Gekishin. Or if it is an old ma master Saitaku. Um, take care, and I'll be not trampled to death. Yo ho ho! I was on my I, I was on my way back to Kin, but then caught away the dread set out. You think from me? Do not underestimate Riboku and Hogan. If you think of them as mere young upstarts, you will pay dearly for it. Yo, young upstarts. That is interesting. Do not underestimate Riboku and Hogan. Are we about to see Hogan versus this this Kikishin dude? Oh man, yo, cause I, H Hogan's like one of the top tiers for me, man. Yo, he went in. So I would underestimate the man who defeated Oki. That's factual, man. I like like I said, like this before. Oki, o Oki, Oki's a savage. He 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 was just that dude. But Hogan, man, I, yeah. I mean, of course, I prefer I prefer Oki. O o Oki's like. Him, him, Kyokai, and Konki are like my three favorite characters. But man, dude, Hogan went in. He he went in like a savage. He was like a one man army. You know, he he, he was like he was like a flipping a pr pr prime King Recon Marvel for two. Yo, give him the UMP forty five going in, chopper gunners all day, yo. nukes, just, dude, it, over. All right, us men in the east have never had the chance to cross swords with with you can in the west. But if someone was rampaging in the, in the same era, I'm well aware of the Kin Six General's strength. However, fellows like that Hoken man, I am well accustomed to. Bio. It's much, much firm. It's called the Path Seekers and hid away from. Wow, Bio. Wait, it, it, it wasn't that. Wasn't that that one mountain tribe from the beginning of the story? Whenever the Buddhists were not in the village, going on around some tribe being a boo, uh, booshing. Wasn't it Bio the, the one in the beginning of the story? With the mountain tribe, wasn't that? Uh, I don't remember. It's, it's been a while, dude. It's like last year. Look at this. I can't even re remember how many of those idiots I cut down in my youth. In his youth. Let me see. Yo, -ho. if you would be so kind as Chan Chance Rio, tell him that so long as he compensates me more than Yan, I wouldn't mind moving over to Chen either. Yo, for money, man, he'll go over there an instant. So he's one of those guys. And then for you, it's all about money, isn't it? Indeed, it's all about the money. There exists a proverb in China known as Jian Zi Wei Shi, or as the translation goes, to first begin with Wei. It is said that in the past, the king of Yan, King Shou, was faced with a kingdom that was on the brink of ruin and so summoned his vassal Guo, Guo Wei to discuss uh, the cities. 
Yo, look at these dark demonic eyes, yo. I, for some, 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 stuff like that is really cool to me. I don't know. It's just the way that it's designed. It looks really nice. And the fact that like, there's a little, little just tinsy, ritzy white in all that darkness, it just looks so cool. To which go away replied this. If that is what you desire, your majesty, then please begin by showering your humble servant go away with lavish gifts. By doing that, more talented men than, than me from across the lands will definitely gather in our kingdom. And sure enough, when news traveled that the king of Sho had bestowed riches upon Go Away, highly skilled men began to flock towards the lands of Yan. And there was none more fitting to represent all these fortune seekers than the military god Gakuki, and the current number one general of Yan, Gakishin. In essence, Gakishin was a man who had abandoned his motherland of Zhao and moved to Yan on the promise of riches alone. I must confess, I am not fond of Gakishin. Jobless is his country just for gold. I mean, he's, he's he's a man who works for money. You know, he's, he he, gets, he kind of seems like as a, a mercenary worker. You know, they 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 go to where they're paid. If they pay them here, that's where they get money. You know, that, that's just that's just the way it is. Let me see. Indeed, though he's not well known in Chin, he's certainly a monster himself. Fella said that if he had chosen to remain in Zhao instead of fucking, he would have well climbed his way to be to even one of the three great heavens. Riboku. This was that army. Bokusama, if we're not careful, they might. There's no need to worry. This is nothing more than a simple prologue for what's to come. I shall demonstrate to you what it is to win through overwhelming difference in strength. Yo, Riboku's about to play no games. Yo, but 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 is my man Hoken really about to come in there though? Kakishin's battle. Oh, you already see a head fly. <laughs> Kingdom! Heads already flying is going in Reboku. Chapter 252, Gekishin's battle. He's smiling, yo. He's he's a guy that works for money, but he does his job right, man. That's what people pay him the big bucks. After only half a day. Ah, oh, you're pretty good, Reboku. In fact, I say that you're twice the man I had imagined you to be every single one of the hands I've played so far. I feel like read by him. And it's unthinkable. There is far too large a gap in experience between the two of us. First, I have, I have accumulated close to 60 years. 60 years of, of life on the battlefield. Most of all, I hold within my head all the taxes and knowledge of warfare that, that belong to the military god Gakuki himself. Gakishin's words were most likely not an exaggeration. Is that a young Gakishin right here? Kind of looks like a little bit like, like Mush. No, I can't even see that. His hairstyle is like, like, kind of like um, Musashi. Great general of Eastern China, yo. This looks like a beast. Gakuki. The voices of people would give cry to one named Gakuki. Yo, this Gakuki guy had to have been insane, man. The god of military, bro. And that's an insane freaking tag for me. He would literally dub the god of military, dude. What's the bridge up Yo. This guy was goat. Gakuki. It was Gakishin who accompanied Gakuki's side when down to the east. The moment he arrived in Yan, the hot headed young general Gakishin he dedicated, his, he dedicated his entire body and soul towards stealing Gakuki's way of warfare. Yo, this is like a, like, this is a strat, dude, this is just experience, I mean, Riboku said it, he said it's gonna be uh, uh, the different, the battle and difference in strength, we're the strategy this time around. All the small cautions that have occurred so thus far have gone as if he could see right through me, that's right, if it's, but why the right? For the poison cats who are known as Simon's assassination army to be continuously eluded. No. The reason why the poison cats have been unable to capture the enemy HQ is because it does not exist. There are all there, there are all of those are merely fakes that have been set up in advance. Then where is the real thing? 
He's been able to see right through my hand. No, he's not seeing through my hand. He's been watching me all along. Yo, these are some beast panels. It reminds me of like a cinema, you know? They're really, really nice stuff. Your book is closer than I thought, but where? Just why does this hour make a difference? That's because you're sitting right there to my right, aren't you, Riboku? Yo, he got him. Look, it's just mountains. What? We haven't exposed? Yeah, he got him. He got him. I have felt something off. Because they were close to Rebok's position, were terrifying man. When this battle began, he had been directing it from right beside me. Most impressive, General Gekishin. Then number fifteen thousand. We don't, we've only eight eight thousand men here. Because the Poison Dog Unit, which comprised the main force of Gekishin's unit, the Quan Rong. Is he poison cat dog is? God. I have you. Riboku. <gasps> oh, Yo, I almost fell. I see him. I see him. I see him. I see him. He's coming. He's coming. He's taking dubs. Okay. No, 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 no. We don't stop it there. It's like, go. Oh, meaningless battle. I saw. I saw the cleaver. I saw the long hair. He was coming down from the mountains. Meaningless battle. My boy is taking dubs, dude. Okay. Son, the return. Look at this guy. Heads, arms, legs, nothing is safe. Hide the children. Hoken, man. Yo, the double page threads with Hoken are always so beast. Look at my boy's face, his eyes, man, the determination. This guy's a warrior. Hoken is a warrior to death. To death. I mean, he's, he's, just a he's just that dude, man. Here he comes. Just one swipe, just taking off dudes' heads, man. Like he had auto aim. Just whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. look at this crushing dude's skulls. I mean, he's going in. Don't retreat your disgrace. Uh, that said, this man is something. Uh, something that said, this man isn't something any of you can handle. Could be said it so of myself. Gekishin himself. Yo, Gekishin versus Hogan. <laughs> the strength held by a great general is even further beyond reason. A great General Evans. He remembers Oki, bro. You can't take that lightly, son. Cold feet now. Hogan. And you see he comes in, your savage white eyes. Oh. oh. I thought Hogan split his head in half, yo. I legit thought Hogan took his head out right. Right there. Wait. The veins. Kishin Sama. It was a one arm move. What, what is this man? You! Hogan! Wait, did he really just kill him? Wait! He overpowered him! He overpowered this, this legend, Kikishin! And then he cuts him in half! Hogan! He killed him! Yo, the double page spreads with Hogan are insane. Then he calls him fraud. I didn't even see that. Fraud. This man is different from the Bushings I know of. Yo, he was sure he got cut in you. Dude, the double page spreads with Hogan are insane. They're insane. 242 Zhao, General Hogan. He's young General Kakishin and captures 20,000 Yan soldiers as prisoner from the records of the Grand Historian. And just like that, Hokin enters the battle, takes dubs, and he's out of there. He's out! Hokin! Oh, I'm assuming you did not call me after this from about, but of course. However, this battle was a crucial step, step to prepare for the real thing that will come. The real thing? Yo, I thought Kakishin was about to see something massive, but Hokin took him out! <laughs> The real thing. Simply thirst for a true battle. The year will go down as a year of conflict boots with war. But however, there was not a single person at the time who realized that next year would be a terror would bring a terrifying and great war that would encompass all of China. All of China? By the god apart from Riboku, that is. Oh, oh, Riboku was the only one that saw it coming. It's observation hockey, man. Yo, Hogan went in, dude. This one day, someone's over a victory. Hogan, Riboku. Koyoku. Hakure. Rinbukun. A 
of Ren Renpayo. That, that was greatness, man. Forever the Kings is here. Retarded, <laughs> retired old farts. Let me see. <laughs> Come on, man! Stop writing these chapters off like this, yo. Choose young generation. Oh, this is this is a beast. Uh, picture with, with, with my boy Shin, man. He's just got have his armor over him. Really nice. Dress down here, Aishin unit. Pussies. <laughs> Koyoku, man. Koyoku. That's a legendary opening, man. <laughs> Don't forget what Kadio Ten said. We must obey HQ's orders. Yo, Shin flew! And battle ensues! Yo, Shin flew, dude! My boy was taking a league. He, could, he couldn't handle it. Ora! <laughs> yo, there, yo, there, hold on. And Shin comes right back, my boy. There's nothing if it comes. For God's sake, what is Shin doing? I told him, Colin, it's time not to take the bait. I don't know how Shin is, man. No one tries, my boy, yo. You're planning to, to just turn the child now? Shut your mouth. Those are the orders we were given. My name's Koyoku, 1000 Man Commander Shu, also, also known as the Thunder. And this guy here is the youngest member of the Ten Bows of China. 1000 Man Commander Hakude. Oh, I stopped wording it that way. My bow is ranked third in all of China. And it's not that I don't want to fight you as much as, as I'm not allowed to because of, because of orders from the top. Though I'm pretty sure it, it should be the same for you. Come to think of it, I think Ten mentioned something like that. Shin of the High Shin Unit. Looking forward to the real thing. Yo, yo, this whole real thing, man. Is that getting me a little bit of hype, dude? They're, they're really setting this up here. I'm telling you all, the 1,000 man commanders of Chin are all monsters. Second rate trash like you aren't even in the same league. Shin talking down, son. Let me again, Shin Elijah. You're freaking dead next time, monkey. That was mild though, cause it it, it 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 felt it felt like they were actually. Uh... Never mind. I I was about to say if if it, it, it felt like they were actually you know, complimenting them in in, in a sort of way. And Shen just going right back, and he was like, "Nah, man, you guys are trash. You guys are trash compared to the to the beings, to us, to the thousand man over here in Shen. You guys are nothing." She wants to ready for an all-out war. To front line women begin hostile. So that's to uh, hostilities too. Because the large amount of area they hold also works against them. Due to how the state of Chu is so widely spread, they're actually touching the borders of five other states Chin Han, Wei, Zhao, and Qi. Hence, Chu must put on. Such so with their Chin's high command has been working on a grand strategy to be used against Chu as well. He's nothing special. How about you, Ray? Obviously, he's quite strong. He blocked my shot, after all. But, well, he's still a match for Yoku if he has his Bakuya sword with him. Oh, my. So, Yoku's a beast with the sword? Do I go for one more? Do I do it? Uh, do I do it? Ah, I'm tempted. I'm tempted. Should I do one more? Should I do one more? I'll leave it. I'll leave it at that. I'll leave it at that. We'll, we'll, we'll continue off next time with, with here with Yoku. Apparently, well, what's the next chapter going to be called? Chancellor of State, Chapter Two Hundred Fifty Five. Oh man, dude, I see Say right here. I kind of want to continue reading, dude. Hold on, yo. So we say Say in the chair. We see the Chancellor report. At this time, a most strange event was occurring in the royal capital of Kanyo. So we have to pick it back to the refugee camp. Political parties of the Ed that this is from the before we do the rumors of his affair with the Queen Mother. Oh snap. 
Yeah, I remember that. I remember that. Because I was posting it on, on Twitter. I was laughing so hard. What was everyone suddenly coming back to the safe action? Losing powerful allies one after another. Jinjo Fui's camps hasn't made any conspicuous moves either. Just what? Just what is happening? There was a reason why the safe action wasn't, were not able to fully comprehend the situation that was happening around them. Royal harem. <laughs> Yo, going absolutely in, man. Yo, Ro Fui doesn't fake. Oh, no, this isn't even Ro Fui. The Queen Mother's just trying to get it in regardless. She's tanking it, son. She just wants it. Let's see. <laughs> yeah, these facial expressions are kingdom are hilarious, dude. A mysterious man. <laughs> <laughs> these facial expressions, man. A mysterious man by the name of Roy had suddenly appeared in the royal harem that was by normally permitted by two males. But due to the hostile nature of the royal harem, news of him has yet to lead to the outside world. Hence, even the Rafui faction themselves were puzzled as to the reason for, <laughs> for this sudden influx of allies. Oh, bad. <laughs> Real Rishi. Rishi's all, may I request one moment of your time? The royal harem faction has been influencing people behind the scenes, you say. Everything has gone according to the Chancellor's plans. She'll explain from the beginning first. The Chancellor had, sent, had me search for a man who would be well versed in the acts of pleasuring women folk. And then had his beard and eyebrows shaved and smuggled into the Royal Hermit as an Enoch. It's the Royal Hermit for what purpose? Now she attacked as the mother, as the Queen Mother's pleasure partner. <laughs> Yo, man, they be going in, dude. The Chancellor disliked being the recipient of the Queen Mother's personal invitation, but at the same time, he could not afford to lose her and the Royal Crown's support. <laughs> it's the sweat, man. I'm telling you, like, like they, they be portraying this, like, like, like they're they're in their last breaths, man, trying 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 to bust that one nut, you know? Sweating, son, talking about. I mean, listen, man, uh, they must have been lasting long, long, man, in them times, yo, because, yo, their entire bodies be sweating, bro. Either that or they, they no, of course, they have no air conditioning. But, man, yo, they be sweating, like, and, and then the face looks fresh, dude. It's just, it, it's hilarious. I, I, I love the, this, I uh, love the way that, the... <laughs> that joke is funny every time, dude. I went to the Chancellor predicted the Queen Mother has been completely captivated by Roy's body. Not only is the Chancellor free from the Queen Mother, Three good families were sitting for the realm has also begun to win this game faction. So when the Chancellor really didn't did, really did commit adultery with the Queen Mother after all. Whatever the main main issue now is rules forbidding the entry of men into the harem most certainly are not to be taken lightly. This is really impossible. That Chancellor would be utterly destroyed. No one what? The Chancellor's orders have already ha have already had every single person related to the scheme assassinated you. That's how you know that you truly want to get I have something under the wraps. You know what I mean? Right now the only people who know of this secret are myself and Rishi Sama. And why did you choose to tell me of this? The Chancellor bade me to pass it on to you. Is that so? The fact that one of that one of R Ryo Fui's officials was found to be assassinated in a room that night did not become big news in the casino. Well, let me read that again, because I got distracted by this, by this head. This head got destroyed. The fact that one of the Rio Fu's officials was found to be assassinated in the room that night did not become big news in the city of Kanyo. It appears the Queen Mother has taken quite a liking to that man. Rio Fu, man. The, the gifts of the three great families at ranks have swelled so much they're fit to burst. I had planned to tell you, but was too occupied with the affair. Besides, you could say that I wanted to settle this matter with my own hands. Whatever, it's already over and done with. I'd say it's time I let out all the pent-up frustration I've been accumulating. Rishi, it's time I graduated from Chancellor. Sir? At last, your free had managed to obtain the seat of Chancellor of State, a position even higher than his previous role of Chancellor of the Right. Chancellor of State could consider the highest, poss the highest position possible in the real court. At this point, the only other position above it will be the king's throne. Definitely something to think about there. The state's position remained empty, but Rufui was able to utilize his power and influence to place himself onto the seat. From this point on, it's not just Chancellor anymore. Make sure you address me correctly, lest your head roll. Yo, Rufui, man. <laughs> Saying the rest of his faction were utterly helpless to oppose this, to, to oppose this outrage. Come to this, we have no choice but to start from square one again. No. 
If we were able to hold out and overcome this trial, then we still have a fighting chance. We must do whatever it takes to even the odds between our two factions right now. But sire, we have no uh, we, we no longer have any methods available to us. Your Majesty, come with me. This is don't tell me. Let's go. Open the doors. Sick, yo, this bastard from the beginning of the series. It's been quite a while. Yo, I, I, I forgot this guy was even alive. Well, well, what a surprise. You suddenly took your sweet time, didn't you, Elsay? I, I kind of want to keep going, man. And, uh, I, I gotta stop it there. I gotta stop there because if not, I'm, I won't be able to continue. But you guys have an awesome day. Thank you so much. Kingdom greatness. We'll continue next time with chapter 256, right? We'll continue next time with 256. Yeah, I'm in there, yo.